Hello. In this video, we are going to learn how to do median imputation and mean imputations to impute for some values in the data set using our programming language. For the purpose of demonstration, I have loaded a small data set and it looks like this. It has got two variables and the variable 1 has got two missing values and the variable 2 has got three missing values. Let us check out the summary of the data. The summary clearly indicates that the variable 1 contains two missing values and the variable 2 contains two missing values. Now to choose between mean imputation and median imputation it is necessary that we should take a look at the distribution of the data set. So for that let us plot the histogram of the variable 1 which turns out to be pretty symmetrical and let us take a look at the histogram of the variable 2 and it turns out to be skewed symmetrical. Now so in the first case we can use the mean imputations for uh, because it's easy to interpret and however in the next case it's probably not advisable to use the mean imputation because mean probably here does not represent a good uh, measure of centrality because it is the distribution being skewed because it tends to be dragged more towards extreme values and in this case over this region. So in case of a distribution like this it is better that we input the missing values using the median of the rest of the observation present in the variable. So let's do it. Let's impute the missing value of the first variable by uh, using the mean imputation so mean imputation for variable 1 so let us set all the missing values of the variable 1 by the mean of the rest of the values in the data in the variable 1 and that is it and let use the median imputation for variable so this is equivalent to setting all the variables, all, all, all the missing values present in the variable 2 to the median of the rest of the values present in the variable 2. So here we go, data dollar variable 2. And set it to the median of all the other values, non missing values present in the variable 2. And we are done. Now, if you see the data that we have loaded, see this no longer contains the missing values. We have imputed all the missing values present in the variable 1 using the mean of the rest of the variables present in the variable 1 whereas we have imputed all the missing values that were present in variable 2 using the median of the non-missing observations present in the variable. So thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Hope you enjoyed. Goodbye.